I'm better than my mom at cooking, I think. Hey! Hey guys! One of our resolutions this year was to get the kids cooking more for themselves. We've been having a lot of fun practicing, and today Brooks is going to show your kids how to make three easy breakfast recipes. All right, you ready to cook? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to leave, and Brooks is going to show you his three recipes. Tell us what you're making today. I have scrambled eggs. Yes. Banana pancake. Yep. And these really yummy sticky buns. All right, good luck. I'm gonna be right over there. All right, so first we're gonna make our scrambled eggs. I'm really hungry, so I'm gonna do three. So now I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands. You wanna wash your hands, because the eggs have lots of germs in them. Okay, so now we're gonna pour some milk in. This kind of makes it a little like the egg's a little fluffier. So now we can start whisking this. You need to be extra careful if you're using a small bowl, because it's really easy when you're whisking for it to get out of the bowl. I need the camera to follow me because I'm going to bring it to the sink okay, to put so this on. Okay. I'm going to bring the bowl and the whisk over so I can wash the whisk. So now we're ready to put the eggs on the stove and get cooking. We are going to turn the stove on, bring it to light. I'd say that's about good. We're gonna go ahead and pour the eggs in. And now we're gonna wait a little bit. This is my least favorite part, waiting for the eggs to be ready. It takes a little time, but once you see it's kind of coming up on the sides, it looks a lot like eggs. Now I think it's time for us to flip it. I'm gonna get all the way under to the other side and you're gonna flip it. So I can turn this off. Mom, I turned the stove off. Here's the best part. Now we get to put them on the, on the plate. Oops. And voila, scrambled eggs. Avery, come have some scrambled eggs with me. Mmm. This is the best part, definitely. Now we're making the two ingredient banana pancakes. So now we're gonna open this banana. Oddly satisfying. So now we're gonna put it in the bowl and smush it. We have to smush this really, really well. These are when muscles come in handy. I'm good at this. I'm better than my mom at cooking, I think. Hey. Okay, so now the same thing as the scrambled eggs. Crack this egg, now the next egg. So now we're gonna whisk. And you can also go around and if you see anything that you didn't smush, you can go and smush it again. So now we're gonna cook the banana pancakes. So I have a couple tips for you that my mom and me discovered that they really help. The first one is just a safety tip. This should never be facing you. And also, you want the pan to be really warm. And next you need really small scoops so that it'll be easier to flip and a really thin spatula so it'll be easier to flip. So let's pour this baby in. We're gonna do it right in the middle. So now we're waiting for like the edges to get cooked. This is something me and my mom had to practice a bit. We learned you can't flip too early. Ooh, that looks pretty good. Now you need to really get completely under it. I think I did a really good job on that one. And that's a wrap on the banana pancakes. Mmm. They could use a little maple syrup, but they're good plain because they have lots of flavor in them. Mm. So now for our last kid recipe, we're making semi-homemade, super yummy, sticky buns. So the first step is cutting the butter, but you need to cut the butter really big. And I'm using my kid knife. We're gonna fill it up, so we're gonna put one in. I like this part, because you get to get your hands all messy, and I like getting messy. We're gonna put some brown sugar in. I put lots of brown sugar in because I like mine to be really sweet. So we're gonna go ahead and put brown sugar in all the pans. 
So now we can put some pecans in some of them. I'm gonna make two for my mom. So now for the tricky part, I might need my mom for this, but we're gonna try to open these biscuits. A little help here, mom. Get ready, here, help me. <laughs> Don't push my hand, just. <laughs> Oh, these are hard. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh wait, here. We're supposed to. Oh, and then you can open it. See if you can do it. Voila. Now I get to put them in. I like to push my biscuits down so that the toppings stay on better. That's a key tip. So now we're gonna put them in a 350 degree oven. I get to put them in. Okay. For about eight minutes. If you have any extra slots, Make sure to fill them up with a little bit of water so that they don't burn. Mmm. This is so good. Thanks. You're welcome. Avery, you've never met a sweet that you didn't like. All right, guys, I'm pretty impressed with everything Brooks was able to make today. So next time you're tired of cereal, I hope you give these a try. Because it's easier to make breakfast than you think. We'll see you next time. Bye, Bye guys. guys. Where are you looking, Brooks? Are you looking into the camera? Into the camera. Yeah, with that kind of smile. So now we're ready to put the stoves on the... To... <laughs> <laughs> that milk makes it kind of puffier, right? Because I just want to make sure I'm right. Because yeah. what if I'm wrong? <laughs>